pharmacist arrested at the airport, accused of sex trafficking. Authorities say it's part of an international crisis. Local 10's Christina Vasquez live in Miami with the shocking details. Christina. And he is facing those charges pertaining to the attempted sex trafficking of a minor. And you're about to learn why a mayor in a city in Colombia is weighing in about this federal case right here in Miami. Federal investigators say earlier this month, just as Miami pharmacist Stefan Andres Correa stepped onto a Miami International Airport jet bridge to board a flight to Colombia, an outbound border search revealed the 42 year old who was traveling alone was carrying approximately nine cell phones. On some of those devices, they would discover videos of him engaging in sex acts with young girls. And they found this a text message exchange with what appears to be a sex trafficker arranging a victim's age, just 12 years old, price, and place. Medellin. On the platform X, the mayor of Medellin, Colombia, sounding off about the case, which comes on the heels of other high profile arrests pertaining to the sex trafficking of minors there, stating, quote, these abuses against our children have been occurring with great intensity for years. We are not going to rest in this fight that has only just begun, adding a hashtag don't even try it. Unfortunately, since the cocaine cowboy days back in the 80s, there has been a war on children and that has led to sexual exploitation of children. Attorney Kristen Reynoso Jacqueline has represented clients involved in DHS investigations. She says prosecuting cases is not only one of the objectives outlined in a partnership between the U.S. and Colombia signed two years ago, but explains why, in her view, it is key to robustly combating child sex tourism. There's 200,000 children in Colombia that are affected by sex crimes every single year. and, ver and a mere couple of thousand actually are prosecuted. So making more strides to assure that the prosecution does happen and these children are treated as victims as opposed to perpetrators themselves. Explain why authorities in Colombia are watching this federal case out of Miami. Investigators say Correa did tell them that he flew to Colombia on occasions to have sex with minors. His hearing has been reset to tomorrow morning. Reporting live for you, I'm Christina Vasquez, Local 10 News. So, so disturbing. All right, uh, Christina.